it going to happen tonight, Al? It's got to. That's the way I look at it. Because if it doesn't happen tonight, it's not going to happen at all. A very astute appraisal. Well, it isn't an appraisal, Elvira. It's a reminder. The six months, the time limit. The six months will be up tomorrow. Tomorrow? Six months. Those are the rules. I know the rules, but the exact date. This menu is dated January 10th. And? At midnight, you know what day it'll be? Saturday. Go on. The 10th of July. Well, well, well. You did know after all, didn't you? I haven't lost this one yet. But you will, Al. You're going to lose this one. And the score will be tied again. Two and two. But as of now, the score is not tied. I am still ahead. Two and two, Al. Two and two. The little manicurist, what was her name? You know, goddamn well her name, Linda. Well, I'd forgotten it already. But I knew you had it. Linda. Linda and Betsy. That's two, Al. I count two. Two big failures. Two big goose eggs. The two that got away. If you want to stroll down memory lane, my love, we could spend an entire evening on the Shell gas station attendant. All right. Or the Olympic pole vaulter. But I am not playing the game this evening. I'm not at bat, as it were. The evening isn't over yet. As far as I can see, it is. In fact, I'd be willing to bet it is. You're not usually a gambling man. True. And I'd even make a small token wager. Such as? The boy. Is he yours to bet? What would you say? What would your astute appraisal be? I would say it would be possible with a few well-chosen words and a pair of cowboy boots. <laughs> that is an astute appraisal. Well? I have two hours, right? Those are the rules. And if by the end of that two hours I have um, achieved Betsy... Then you may have him too. I will not even touch him. I will dispense with him. I will give him to you. That great personal sacrifice, I might add. You see, El, you wouldn't appreciate him half as much as I would. And worse than that, he wouldn't appreciate you.